Hi YouTube, this is G-Jack back with another video. In this video, I'm going to be doing a PC build. And this is pretty much going to be the cheapest PC I could find. And I chose all the parts for it. And I tried to make it as less as possible. So it's under $200. It is... Oh, it's only 200 It's $303. So maybe you can go $3 lower budget on your computer. So, yeah... For the CPU, I chose Intel Core Duo Tray Processor, which is 15 bucks, and I really don't know how well this will run. Like, I I don't even know if that'll work, but 15 dollars for a CPU seems like a steal, as long as it loads up your computer. I guess it's a CPU, and CPU cooler is a Thermaltake CLP0497 CPU cooler. And this is just a basic CPU cooler where you just simply push in the push tabs or screw them in, I don't know. And it's just a fan. There's no copper bars or anything like that. Just a simple fan. It actually looks pretty easy and simple to use. For the motherboard, I chose Intel GG DG41TY Micro ATX LGA775 motherboard. The, the reason this is $75 is because... All this crappy equipment would only fit on one motherboard, and it was this one, so it had to be this one. There's no other motherboard that fit all this. So, for the memory RAM, I chose the 1 gigabyte stick of memory by Corsair. Mm, I really don't know what to think about this, but it's 1 gigabyte of RAM, so if you have an 8 gigabyte computer, multiply it by point. Point eight or something. I don't, I don't give a crap. It's, it's it, all I'm gonna say is it's gonna be really slow and it's not gonna load your stuff up very quick. For storage, I chose the Western Digital Caviar Blue 80 gigabyte internal hard drive. 8 gigabytes you can actually store probably about maybe eight or nine movies and maybe one game like Minecraft or something like that. But you you don't. I mean, if you're just trying to goof off and make a $200 computer, 8 gigabytes is all you need for 16 bucks. That's actually a pretty good deal. Only 16 bucks, so that's less than a penny per gigabyte. So I mean, less than a less than a dollar per gigabyte. So for the video card is the PowerColor Radeon one gigabyte video card. Now in the description of this. It said it could play GTA 5 at max frames, so I would definitely go for it. It's 13 bucks. I think it's worth it. It's like the size of a stapler. For the case, I chose the Rosa Well FBM 02 Micro ATX Mini Tower Case for $15. Now, this is not for the looks and stuff. This is just some something simply you put under your desk. You kick it while you're using your computer. Your dog pees on it once in a while. It's not anything to be fancy with a with a glass case and see all the junk and stuff. But if you want to be really cheap, you can just not get a case and put it all like just put it on the desk next to you. That actually worked though. It actually would work if you want to try it that way. But I'm not going that way. Now for the power supply, I chose the 480 watt Logius power supply for. Twelve dollars. Now, I would plug this into like, um, maybe a like one of those extension cords that are like shock resistant. Cause I don't know if this is gonna blow up in your face when you use it, but I never heard of the brand Logius, and so I would not trust it a hundred percent. It's like maybe I would wear some like unstatic clothes or something like that because it might blow up because for only twelve dollars a 480 watt power supply seems pretty scary so yes this is only 100 wait what the how did it go from 203 dollars at the beginning of the video to 191 but whatever it's even less now so it's 191 which is pretty good for a computer i mean it actually runs so that's pretty good and this computer only takes 175 watts, so it's not gonna like make your power bud power bill go crazy or something. So yeah, if you like this video, don't take this video seriously. This is just a video 
for maybe people who just want to watch a video and are bored. But if you're actually going to build this, I'll take extreme precautions because some of these things actually will probably blow up. I'm not even joking. But whatever. I'll see you in the next video. And please like, subscribe if you liked the video. And thank you for watching the video. Bye.